Atlanta, tough game today, nil nil. What are your thoughts? I think that uh, LA Galaxy is a really good technical team and uh, they make pressure on us the uh, whole game. We are ex expecting something like this. Uh, I think like a uh, team that we play very well our defensive shape and uh, first half they didn't create almost nothing, second half they create a few really good chances. Uh, but even we had something uh, from, from second half but uh, I think overall we need to be more dangerous when we play home. And even okay, the the, the plan was that uh, that we are staying more in the uh, middle block, and from middle block that we create something. And uh, in this part, I think we c we need to create more. We need to show quality up. And then near the end, you had two important saves. What did you see there? Uh, yeah, for me, the most difficult ball maybe it was this deep ball when I clear with the head. Then uh, then these two okay from free kicks. It was okay, and second one, uh, okay, it was it was nice, uh, nice save in the end of the game. Uh, very important for me, another clean sheet. Uh, I think my uh, defense play very, very well on high level. Even when they get some opportunities, they block uh, fantastic. Uh, they, they they stop uh, Jovic in two, three shots, and uh, it's much easier for me this season than if I will compare with the uh, last two seasons. Yeah, speaking of that, I mean, this team has become a difficult team to score on. What are maybe some of those ingredients that you're seeing that is just compared to last year, you know, like it felt like the team leaked more goals this year. You guys are just better defensively. Yeah, because uh, we are working on this defensive uh, side. Uh, they are working with a uh, coach for, for defense and uh, we are speaking a lot uh, during the week, during the trainings, how they need to, how they can help goalkeepers uh, more than uh, they are doing uh, last season or or even uh, in these preseason games, like uh, how we grow up. And I think all these now 14 games we play on high level, maybe it was some gap of three, four games where we, where we go a little bit down, but now we are like on a really high level from this standpoint. Have you changed your communication style with the defense this year as opposed to previously? No, I didn't change nothing. Just like uh, uh, honestly, this is the 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 from the coach. Like he put this uh, tactics, he put this shape, and uh, it really it really works. And uh, everything is from him. I I cannot change my like if we will go to high press or low press, he make decision. But uh, I think how he uh, prepare from the start of the preparation till now our team. I think a uh, whole team play a really good defense. But the way you talk to your defenders and you're giving them information, is that evolving? Yeah, how we can, grow, when we grow up, then I can go straight to them uh, some information, what they can understand. And maybe last season they, I cannot give this uh, straight uh, information because we didn't spoke about this. And then it's difficult on the game to change something. Uh, it seems like your ability to kind of clear those loose balls, those 50 50s over the top, like clearing them with your head and sweeping uh, play away, has, uh, the timing seems like they're really improved. Has that something you've worked on since last season? Yeah, even last season, I think last uh, eight, nine games, I improved a lot on this. And yeah, if I can say something that was like, uh, I was not on high level with, this, uh, with these things, uh, but uh, last eight games in, in the last season and this whole. Uh, all games in this season, I think uh, I'm on a really high level on, on this, and I, I think I can help a lot with uh, uh, to team on these deep balls because uh, it, really it's not easy to go up every time on this uh, type of balls. But my goalkeeper coach uh, last season he helped me a lot with this, with my positioning, how I need to be, where I need to be positioned when when somebody has the ball. And uh, this, it helped me a lot. And I think I, I improve, I will say, 100% in, in these things. Uh, the crowd was yelling your name at the end, you know, the fans, Kalina, Kalina, just how good does it feel to just have that backing of, you know, the fan base and they appreciate what you do? Yeah, it's great because uh, I work for myself and for them uh, every day, every week. And uh, I'm the most happy person when, uh, when I can get clean sheet or good saves for them. And uh, I think, uh, I think they know that I appreciate this because this gives me a really big power. Even in away games, uh, every time we have uh, 
some fans and uh, yeah, they are, they are yelling my name and uh, yeah. And I, I recently had an opportunity to interview Carol Swiderski and he mentions that he texted you a lot before games. Did you get a chance to talk to him before tonight's game? Before tonight's games, we, we didn't spoke, but last week, yeah, every every week we are in touch and uh, yeah, we are really good friends and uh, yeah, all the time he's in contact and he knows everything what happened in the team. Okay. Good. All right. Thanks, Kelly. Thank you. Appreciate it.